So I just wanted to give you a brief tutorial of the tools I'm using. Just a little small review. I have uh, Edger attachment um, to my Murray that would fit on a Ryobi, any type of Ryobi motor. I was using attachments, so I kind of got uh, spoiled on using um, attachments. So when I say attachments, I mean the Ryobi uh, motor has this thing where you can attach different type of tools. So what on here today, I have a Ryobi uh, mini tilter. Uh, and I use that for small gardens, small gardens um, that needs a little tilting before we do mulch. And another attachment that I have for the Ryobi is my Ryobi hedge trimmer attachment and it comes in handy because when I put it on the Ryobi it uh, gives me a nice length unlike a lot of hedge trimmers that are short and sometimes on those bushes they have a nice wide span so you need some long hedge trimmers to cut them all right guys the steel fs 131r and uh it's very powerful very powerful and uh that's what i have on my trailer and apparently one of my pins wasn't in there and i'm glad i didn't lose it but i do have spares okay Next tool, we're going to be, we used a BR700X on the backpack floor. That's BR700X. And uh, my opinion, it works very well, very, very well. Now, my John Deere is a 42 inch John Deere zero turn. It cuts very well. I bought this lawnmower with only 24 hours on it. So it's practically brand new and I've had it for about three years. So you can imagine what kind of hours it has on it now. It has a 22 V twin horsepower engine and it's very powerful, very powerful. Now on my trailer at this time, what I'm using is a 16 inch Toro 6.5 horsepower. It doesn't have to be primed or anything. It's just ready to start at all times. Okay. Spin around here. We're gonna show you what type of edger I use. It's a steel FC 95. And it's pretty powerful. I really like it. Uh, 